And with a developing story tonight, chaos on the Yukon campus triggered by a controversial speech from a far-right political commentator. News 8 spoke with Lucian Wintrich today, whose speech last night was titled, It's Okay to Be White. He was arrested after a wild melee and later released. Yeah, it is a story now getting national attention. Tonight, we're hearing for the first time from the president of Connecticut's NAACP about it. News 8's Bob Wilson live in our Hartford newsroom with the very latest tonight. Bob? We just came back from the Yukon campus where we found the head of the NAACP, Scott X. Esdale. He was up there saying, you know what, it's a very emotional time up there, a lot of unrest. And there was a big meeting in the African American Cultural Center where they talked about the disturbance and arrest. There's obviously a serious race problem on Yukon's campus. Pulling no punches, the head of the Connecticut NAACP on the Yukon campus tonight to talk with students about last night's outburst. It was standing room only and students spilled out into the hallway at the African American Cultural Center. For this type of outburst to happen, uh, there seems to be a little powder keg here and that we don't want this to get bigger and worse. Just to give you a different perspective on the meeting, take a look in through the windows. It's absolutely packed in there. And Scott X. Esdale, he says tonight he's going to meet with the administration. He's going to have a talk and try to bridge the gap because he says there's a lot of work to be done here on the Yukon campus. You think that this is a liberal state. You think that this is a state that, you know, this stuff would never happen in. But, you know, it's pervasive on our college campuses, and it's extremely important, once again, that we deal with it. Last night, Lucian Wintress tried to speak on the campus about race baiting. <laughs> Students kept cutting him off, and eventually a student stole his speech from the podium, and he ran into the crowd to get it back and was arrested for breach of peace. It's sad. I mean, you know, yesterday evening, students were were breaking windows, throwing smoke bombs into the building. The title of his speech, It's Okay to Be White, he says, points out that times have changed so dramatically that the phrase, It's Okay to Be White, brings out anger and protest. Even saying something so innocuous as It's Okay to Be White will be taken in an, a very inflammatory way. That was the joke, and that, that was addressed during the speech itself. Unfortunately, that, that point didn't, uh, <laughs> didn't go through correctly. Now, Esdale hopes to meet with Susan Herbst, president of UConn, sometime in the next week or two to try to find a path to get things back on track. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in the Harvard Newsroom, News 8.